Wilton, California. It's where I come, come home to all the time and I love it. It's already swim time at the end now. BMW offered me to come to DTM, then I have to be in Europe. They gave me the option to stay living in California though, which I really wanted to do because my whole family's in California and my kids are young and my wife has a job there and so I wanted to stay there. And also, I wanted to continue to race in the U.S. as much as possible. Yep, that's right. Great family shot, so cool, love to see that. And uh, I do a lot of traveling just like that and going to Munich, to Frankfurt, Brussels. Pretty much the routine has been this year as I go to my team, BMW Team RBM in Brussels. The team picks me up. The team's really great about getting me to airports and stuff. And I see the team say hello, see what the news is, what people have done, you know, whatever. And I tell them what I've done. That camaraderie is really important. They have to respect you, and you have to respect them. And um, you have to like each other. And you know, I always say, when I'm comfy, I'm fast. I do my best when I'm comfortable. That means I have to enjoy my environment, you know, and I have to like the people I'm around. Bart has been really good, a really good person for me because he's, he's, uh, I would say he's pretty straightforward, which I like. Put frosting on top, you know. Was I, was I good or was I bad? What do you think? I have been to Brussels probably six, seven times now, and he takes me to lunch. We've been to dinner two or three times, and yeah, just lunch by ourselves, you know. And good places, good food, you know. And I enjoy good food. Since I was 11 years old, I've lived out of a suitcase. Right now, I do 240 nights in hotels. So far, after all these years, whatever, 23 years of racing, I still enjoy it. Hotels are great because when you're done, you know, you just leave your towels and when you come back, they're all clean and everything's good. You know, at home, I do my own laundry, so it's actually like a little mini vacation every week. You got the kids in school okay? Yep, everyone's fine. Okay. You know, driving race cars, in my mind, it's a cool job and something that I love and I'm passionate about. And it gets even better in the fact that, you know, I'm traveling and I'm, yeah, I have to leave my family, but when I'm going away to Europe, I really do get to see things. Even like Brussels, you know, you see little shops, you go to little corners and little places and you look and you're like, I have no idea where I am, but it's kind of cool. I thought we were going to drink it from here, <laughs> with a straw. I also carry my golf clubs in the back of my car here in Europe. You get to see cool golf courses, things you may never see in your life. Even though it's relaxing, it keeps me thinking, and my mind is not one to sit. Golf just keeps my mind kind of working, and for me that's, uh, well I'd say it's healthy. My goal has been since I came here to win. I do not leave my family in California for any reason but to win. Probably the reason why I'm here is since I was 12 years old, I only have gone out to win. It doesn't matter if it's practice, it doesn't matter what kind of car I've driven, I go to win. You can see that things are starting to happen. All the races have been quick, we just need to put it all together. I always wanted to drive race cars. I started going to races when I was two years old. I definitely dedicated my life to it. And you know, if somebody said, would you, would you change anything? No, I would still do it the same way. I, I get to drive race cars and I think that's pretty cool.